Alright guys, I'm here at Angel Stadium with my teacher Patrick Sandoval. It's a great pleasure to see you. You had some great outings. How did you feel about your pitching at this time in the season? I'm feeling pretty good. Um, the last one, obviously a good one to build off of and, uh, you know, ready for the next one before the All-Star break to kind of, you know, finish the first half strong. So you have a couple of seasons with this team as far as improvement. How do you feel right now compared to the first time you came up? A lot more comfortable on the mound and uh, around the guys. Um, a lot more trust in, in myself, I feel like, out there, a lot more confidence. Um, I think that's just the biggest thing for me is the confidence is key. What did you like the most about Phil Nevin? I mean, as a manager. Ooh. What do you like? I like his intensity. I like, yeah. yeah, I like the way he, you know, he runs stuff and I like the way that he fights for his guys and, uh, you know, he has all our backs and, you know, he's not going to, doesn't sugarcoat things, tells us how it is, so. I really like that. So Danny is going to the All-Star game with my Trout. What are your thoughts about them and their impact of this team? Um, I mean, I think it goes beyond even this team. Their impact in, in baseball is, and the world is just huge. Uh, you know, what Shohei does on a nightly basis is unbelievable. And same with Trout. He's one of the most consistent players of our generation. Um, and the way that they both carry themselves, it's, it's awesome. How can you describe Otani in the clubhouse? How do you describe him? He's pretty quiet, but when you get past, when you break down the barriers, he's a funny, he's funny, he's very humble, and he's he's just one of the guys. You know, uh, I think that's the best way to describe him from my point of view, at least. How do you motivate each other, each other? every um, day? Just by going out and working together. I mean, me and Noah almost every day. We're going to go out and shag BP and, you know, we make it a competition every day. So you can get the most fly balls or, you know, just anything to, you know, motivate us to to work at a higher level. We, we do talk a lot about, you know, just like our outings and how every game goes for us. And we'll joke with each other if we have like a bad outing. Well, you know, we'll let them know, like, you know, like you're better than that or like, you know, just just have fun with it, you know, keep it light and, you know, not keep things too serious all the time. So, Do you guys exchange a lot of the ideas or, like, techniques on pitching? Um, what you say? Yeah, it's different for every guy. I mean, some guys like to hear what you have to say about their delivery or mm -hmm. the mental side of things, how to, how to navigate through a start, a whole game, and go deeper into a game. Um, there's constant dialogue between the, the pitchers and the starters, so it's... It's a really good uh, work atmosphere, I'd say. You look at your numbers, you look at your, you know, velocity, you look at all these little things. In between starts, I look at, um, you know, when I'm in the bullpen, what my stuff is doing, or even after a start, what my stuff did in that previous outing, and then, uh, you know, try to find a way to either make it better or to use what I have and make it more consistent. And what are you going to be doing in the All-Star break? Like, are you going to go to the All-Star? Are you, uh, you going to just take time no, off? No, I'll, I'll take some time off. I'll definitely watch the game, uh, watch the boys out there. Hopefully we can get Wardo in the game too. I mean, he deserves it. Uh, it's kind of crazy to me that he's not already, you know, on the team, but hopefully he gets in there. All right, Patrick, it was great to yeah. see you and get to know you a little bit more. And, you know, good luck the Thank rest you. of the season. There's still more seasons yeah. left. Absolutely. Thank you.